Yeah, yeah. Okay, um, so usually we start off with uh, saying your name. I'm actually a couple questions. Um, the questions are going to be like, uh, what brings you here? Um, what procedures you got here? What you, you know, why did you get it? And uh, would you recommend this place? And um, what's the, we'll do an outro on that. Sure. Okay. So okay. Just, just, just state your name. My name is Yorgos Canaros. Uh, this is uh, April 18th, uh, 2023, <laughs> sitting here in uh, my Dentist for Life office in uh, Plantation, Florida. And what brings me here? I need uh, help with my sleep apnea because I suffer from not being able to sleep. My profession is bartending, so it's very important for me to sleep a little bit every night in order for me to have the energy it takes to be a consistent in the service industry and uh, not get as fatigued because of fatigue you know catches up to you uh, so I one day I had a little conversation with my mother who was uh, friends with somebody who worked for the company at Vivos and he was a salesman so he told me about this product and I got interested for myself to use it and I couldn't find anybody that actually provided the service in uh, West Palm and Palm Beach County. So I had to travel down here to uh, Broward County to receive treatment. Uh, but, uh, she, you know, I was very happy to find uh, Dr. Rivesby down here. Uh, she was, you know, very knowledgeable and very understanding for my situation and understood how to uh, uh, basically explain to me how the process was going to work and, you know, get me into a, a treatment plan. So that's about it for me. I mean, that's how I got here. That's how I found this place. And that's what I wanted to do was basically sleep better every day because I realized that if I don't sleep good, then, you know, a lot of other people suffer when I don't sleep good. So it's better for everybody if everybody sleeps better. And that's why I recommend this product, uh, the Vivos application, to uh, help you with, you know, snoring, with sleep apnea, with general breathing issues, um, and it saved my life. I, you know, I love to wake up every morning, and I can breathe through both nostrils, and I just feel all around better and stronger and more focused than I used to be. So. Uh, yeah, I know we're uh, diverting a little bit. I want to ask you a, a personal question, but uh, ask. They say that um, it is scary for sleep apnea because you know some people can, you know, die. Die. Yeah, while um, while you're sleeping because you you don't breathe. Yeah. So <laughs> now that you have the uh, the tools you have, how much comfortable? How much more comfortable I am yes. falling asleep? It it makes me way more comfortable. Like honestly, I'll f start getting sleepy like at a normal time, like nine, 10 o'clock at night. And, um, you know, when I'm sleeping, I'm not snoring. So I've had, you know, people that are close to me tell me that when they see me sleeping, they just don't hear anything. They just hear just silent breathing and just me just, you know, passed out. And uh, that gives me a lot of, you know, confidence that you know, I'm going to not have trouble with sleeping and, uh, you know, breathing problems when I'm sleeping in the future. So have you lost a lot of sleep over the past years, like with your condition? Oh, yeah. I mean, I would not be able to fall asleep till like maybe two in the morning because like as a bartender, you come home and you're not able to get sleepy because your melatonin level is all off because of your, you know, adrenals going crazy because you're at work, you know, you're focused on, you know, service. So you're just going 100 miles an hour most of the time. And then by the time your night ends, you still have that momentum from going 100 miles an hour that whole night. And then when you get home, it's hard to wind down after that because your hormones and your everything is just going still. And so it takes a few hours for the hormones to balance themselves out again for your body to be sleepy. However, now my body is able to get into that sleepy mode much faster because it's able to regulate 
the hormones better. I and mean, melatonin being the main one that makes you sleepy, and that's what uh, is affected the most, I feel, when I'm starting to, um, you know, slow down at night from my shift. I'm, I'm glad you got that tool. It sounds like you're gonna have a better night's sleep tonight and forever on. Um, yep. I think that's pretty much it. Oh, um, you could say like, uh, if, uh, would you recommend this office and why? This office, yes, I would recommend. Not only hey, because, we hey, hey, I was telling you, you need the same tool. Double trouble. Sleep, sleep apnea, man. You just got to be. How dude, is it, dude? Game life, major? life changing. Oh, where did you get it? Here. Here, this place. Is it the Opti Sleep? It's the uh, Vivos. Um, Oral appliance. You need that shit, bro. It moves your it, ten millimeters. Yeah, it pushes your palate and jaw forward so that it, it, you're getting more oxygen into your lungs. Yeah, because I don't, I don't like the CPAP shit. And this is a permanent solution, man. As soon as you put this in, like two years later, you're done. You don't need any, like, retainers or anything to hold your jaw in place after that. That's permanent movement. I haven't slept with my girlfriend. He said the snoring stopped. No oh. more snoring. Wow. No more snoring. See, that's like a raw, like a raw testimony right there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, how long was the process? Yeah. I mean, so far I'm in maybe seventh month of my treatment right now, but it's you know dramatically changed my sleeping and my just overall health. You know. You feel a difference in energy levels. Hundred percent. Yes, because I'm able to sleep at night. So yeah. I actually my body gets rested. So I'm waking up. Yeah, I'm able to overweight. actually. Yeah, and I lost a lot of weight too since the beginning of my treatment. Dude, how much weight have you lost? At least uh, 20 pounds. Yeah, because you're not uh, getting enough from breathing, dude. I, I should. Because I, of hormones, it's all hormonal. Oh, oh because yeah. Because your so your your melatonin is what makes you sleep, but you also have the other hormones. You have your, you know, testosterone hormones. You have your adrenal hormones, your pituitary hormones, and all of these hormones are cycled through your sleep cycle. So if Do you you're overbite. Yeah, not that much, but it definitely fixed the uh, um, position even when you lay down, right? Yeah, yeah. So it 100%. pushes the lower jaw? Yeah, it pushes the lower jaw out and also expands it a little bit for your tongue to have room to, to move around. Same thing. I mean, I kept him up all night last night. <laughs> yeah, he was telling me. <laughs> Bro, he's snoring so hard. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's like, were you pretty bad? Like, it was choking, like, sometimes, too? Well, I would stop breathing. Like, just no...